All right, boys, these are some of my favorite style trends for men that I guarantee you most of you have not deployed. Starting with number one, you probably deployed this one, but the cross body bag, I can't get over it, bro. Like, there's so many different styles for you to choose from, whether it's dressy or casual, but what I love the most about him is the functionality. More so than the style is the functionality. I hate, I've talked about it before, having bulges in your pockets, right? The keys, the wallet, the phone, it just, it, it makes your fit look not as perfect, right? The silhouette's not as refined. A cross body bag allows you to store all your essentials, everything you need. You got everything packed up in a nice little bag. It adds that a little extra gist of style, but more importantly, it keeps your fit clean. It keeps your pockets empty. So not only is everything organized, your fits just look on point. Number two, a good sports watch. Look, you know I'm a watch guy. I love watches. I wear a watch every single day. Anytime I can, I throw on a watch. It's a fun moment for me in the morning. But out of all my watches, what I wear the most are the sports watches. Because the good thing with the sports watch, look, I'm wearing a hoodie right now. But a metal band watch, I could wear it now, the hoodie, I could wear that with a suit, I could wear that with an overcoat, I could wear it with a simple t-shirt. A sports watch gives you utility and functionality at the same time. A good one that I also like are rubber strap watches. I used to be against these, but honestly, I picked one up recently, yo. And I've been wearing that a lot. Yes, you're limited on the casual side, you can only wear it casually but it's kind of dope, they're inexpensive, and they look great. Number three, the cowboy boot. Bro, this one's a left field for me. I'm gonna be honest with you. I knew I wanted a pair, and and, and I wanted a pair because I saw my man Ralph Lauren rocking them, and honestly, that guy's a style icon. I saw a few fits, and I'm like, man, I, I think I could do that. I think I could pull it out. When I saw our sponsor Thursday Boot drop some, yo, I hit them up. I'm like, yo, you gotta send me some. You gotta send me some. I'm gonna be honest with you. I've been rocking these hard all winter. And they're gonna roll into spring. They're probably gonna roll into spring. I might even rock them in the summer. I don't know yet, We're gonna, we have to get there. But what I, one thing I can know, not everyone is doing them. And I love, again, if you look at Ralph Lauren for style inspiration, I love like that elevated ruggedness that he does where it's like, he mixes the cowboy boot and the jean with like a blazer or, or like a button down. And it's just like this mix between like luxury and that, like that rugged field work type of outfit, bro, sick, sick. This is one of those style trends I promise you, you have not tried, you gotta. You gotta give it a shot. And with Thursday boots, it's the best. Because with Thursday, you don't even gotta worry about breaking the bank. Yo, Thursday's direct to consumer, they cut out the middleman, and they're going right to you straight from the factory with well-built, Goodyear well-construction boots that you know are gonna last. And I'm not just telling you, yo, you're gonna last because like that's what they're talking, look. I'm telling you they're gonna last from personal experience. I have been working with Thursday boots for well over six years. Some of the boots that I have from them, it's been three, four years, bro. Three, four years, and, and the crazy part is that the more I wear them, the softer they get, like they're comfortable to wear, and the better they look because it's genuine leather. So the more wear and tear you put on them, it's like the more characteristics it builds. And with something like a cowboy boot, you're gonna get just that. Now these specific boots are all handmade in Mexico by some of the best Western cowboy boot manufacturers in the world. And this specific one also has an, a shock absorbing insole that's antimicrobial. And now it makes sense why it's so comfortable to wear. And the best part with Thursday boot, you get free shipping, free returns. So you got nothing to lose, bro. Test them out. I'm telling you, once you throw them on, first of all, they look masculine. They're super rugged. And once you see the style that it adds to your wardrobe, Game changing. If you guys want to check them out, they're going to be linked down below. Takes me to number four, straight fit jeans. I love my loose cut pants stuff. You know, I, I used to wear a lot of skinny stuff, but right now I'm kind of in that straight cut era where it's like, it's, it's right in between, it's timeless, it works with everything, whether it's more fitted clothing, like a fitted sweater, you look luxury, or if you want to wear oversized, like an oversized sweater on top, it's kind of like that perfect in between where you can merge between different aesthetics and it looks good in both aesthetics while it's also not trendy, right? It's like that classic piece that whether loose cut goes out and skinny comes back in, a straight cut pair of denim will always be in play. Five. Thick frame glasses, another move, bro. Look, summers are is about to come. I wear glasses all the time. But when it's summertime, you just need them, right? Like functionally. Thick frame glasses is the move. Not only do they feel sturdier, they look expensive. They look like designer glasses. Because they're so big, they cover more of your face, which means it hides more imperfections, right? More Any facial imbalances you have, thick frame glasses will cover it. But also because a larger part of your surface area of your face is covered by a symmetrical object, your face therefore looks more symmetrical. Thick frame glasses is the move, bro. Number six, a light 
fragrance. Obviously, as the months warm up, you're gonna want stuff that's lighter, more citrusy, a little bit fresher. So when you wear it, because again, right, when it comes to your confidence and how you feel, you want everything about you when it comes to your clothing, your scent, your grooming, to be in line. And what it does is that it overall makes you feel fresher. Bro, your mind's powerful. And every time you take a whiff of your own fragrance, if it feels light, if it feels fresh, even in a hot day that's humid and sweaty, you're gonna feel a little bit more refreshed. And if you match good clothing with that, bro, your whole vibe, your whole aesthetic will be on point. So a light fragrance, you need to pick that up. Ultimately, number seven, a flannel. When the months get hotter, one thing that becomes hard is layering, right? It also gets really hard how to effectively layer without sweating too much or getting uncomfortable. And what I've realized is layering thin jackets or thin shirts or what they call shackets, it's the best move. Where you still get that aesthetic of multiple layers, it looks more complex, it looks more entertaining, but it's not as hot. You throw a tank top under a flannel, bro, you pair it with the cowboy boots and, and the straight cut jeans and, and the thick frames. I basically built you a fire ass fit for summer, bro. I, my, my work here is done, man.